See, he's real fresh. He still's got, got the tails on there, so he just came in. I'm sure he came in on that last rain. We had a, a little shot yesterday and Good fishing is the rule in this video, and we have made doubly sure of it. We have two different rivers to explore, and a pair of professional guides. We are not sure you will learn twice as much, but are pretty sure it will be more fun. As usual, Nick Amato, editor of Salmon Trout Steelheader, is our host, and Nick will be jumping back and forth between Chris Olson's boat and Rob Russell's Rob has some solid techniques for king fishing. He will show us how to rig for plugs, back bouncing, float fishing, and side drifting. The clever part of it all is that he does this with just two rods, modifying the rigs slightly for each application and cutting down on the equipment needed. Chris Olson has the more pleasant of the two assignments. His task is to just catch fish and in the process Tell us some about the habits of king salmon once they enter the rivers. Along the way, we hope you'll get a feel for what some of the important things are to keep in mind while fishing. Though kings are often big fish, it is likely the little things you do will make the difference between an average and an exceptional day on the water. In addition to the knowledge of our chosen anglers, we will draw some of our information from the exceptional Frank Amato publication, Illustrated Rigging for Salmon, Steelhead, Trout written by Robert Campbell. We will look at only a few of the hundreds of great diagrams in the book that detail how your gear should be configured. Perhaps you shouldn't anticipate it, but you can hope that once you've mastered all the skills outlined in the video, that you can have a day like these two buddies of Nick's had. So sit back and enjoy this look at River Kings. See why so many fishermen choose to put in the time and master the skills it takes to catch river kings on a consistent basis. <laughs> this part, I got some logs across the way there, and uh, if we can keep them out of there, you'd be in business. All right. Try and get them that way, Nick, if you can, away from the boat here. Yeah, yeah. They've been taking the eggs and the, yeah, and the plug in there both. Let's throw it in there. Okay, out here, we're smiling. <laughs> <laughs> That's as pretty as they get right there, Nick.